all right you guys so today i am making hamburgers and gravy rice and some sweet peas a quick meal for you guys you may hear my family in the background but that's just life so yeah first i'm gonna start with a little onion powder got some garlic powders a little complete Too. Secret ingredient number one. This the food line brand. Y'all get what y'all want. It's a secret ingredient. And a little mustard. Let's see how it's evenly distributed. Washing hands again. Now we're going to the pan. Okay. So now that you got your meat all seasoned up here, as you can see, then you're not going to turn your oven on yet. You're going to put your burgers in a cold pan. You can patty them out first, however you want to do. If you want thick burgers, make you a little thick, little patty. But this hamburger and gravy, you ain't gonna make them that thick. Cleanse. Now you're gonna turn the stove on a medium heat. And you're gonna let it cook slow. And then we'll come back once we flip them. I hope y'all can see I switched eyes on you. But I'm about to flip them. I don't need no egg in my burgers in case y'all get the ass in. I don't put no egg in there. Side cook for about five minutes. I'm gonna take them out and we'll see. And in case y'all was wondering, that's my steak over there that's been marinated. So I have a hater in my room. What happened? Okay, y'all. So I took the burgers out, as you can see, and it's got the little drippings at the bottom of the pan. You want to keep those? I cut up an onion and put it here. I'm going to take a little butter, 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 butter. And we're going to saute this down. Making sure you scrape to get that look. Ooh, them onions are strong. To get this little thing out. This little, you don't know, the little stuff at the bottom of the pan. Make sure you get that. You need it. You need it. You need that little butter, 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 woo the water. Got my temperature on like a four. And you're gonna let those cook down just a little bit. And then we're gonna come add our pack gravy because ain't nothing wrong with pack gravy. Mm. So now that the onions have gotten sauteed down like this, this is what I'm gonna do. This is what I'm gonna do. I got my little brown gravy pancakes because who you know don't eat these. I'm gonna put three cups of water in here. Um, the sound was kind of messed up because my loud sink it was needing to be repaired this time. So I'm putting three cups of water in here. I think that's my second one. And here comes the third one. If you hear Adrian in the background snoring, that's because he is. I'm gonna stir it up, stir it up, stir it up until I get the clumps up out of it. I'm not sure if I still had to sink on right here or not, but I'm just going to talk you guys through it. So, yeah, I'm just stirring it, getting the clunks out, making sure ain't nothing wrong with that pack gravy. I use it all the time. It's good to me. This is for a quick meal for you and your family, if that's what you choose to do. But just stir, 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 and continue to stir. Um, I added a little more seasoning here. There's some garlic powder. And I think I'm going to put something else in there. Maybe some table blend seasoning, I think. 
Let me see. Let's see what's going on. Yep, I put some table blend in there. Y'all, this is one of the first videos I ever recorded. I'm just clearing out my history right now um, just to make it. Hopefully, I can make it through the month of posting all month. But I want to clear these videos out my phone because I didn't record them for anything. And now you're going to see me put the burgers back. And I think I started talking again right there. Okay, y'all, so I have two cups of water right here. I'm going to add some chicken bouillon seasoning to it, some nori seasoning um, to the two cups of water. Y'all, and also don't mind my stove right here. This is one of the first videos I ever recorded. I'm just trying to clear out my stash, and my sink was loud, the sound was messed up. So, now I'm just about to put some seasoning in there, as I stated before. Just put a little of the nori seasoning in here and wait for it to come to a boil before I add my rice. I'm not sure if I showed you guys all of that. I know I didn't show you a plate plated, but just bear with me. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm learning. So, right here, I'm just checking the water for salt just to see what's going on with it. Um... I just remember this time period in my life. I guess I said it was good. And it's just so crazy to me. Just where I came now. So, just sit back and watch. You guys, just bear with me. This was just me making rice. And like I said, the volume is all messed up. So, I guess I'll see you guys on the next clip. Oh, I'm showing my burgers. So, let me show y'all my hamburgers and gravy. I'm just stirring it up there. Just letting it go. Um, because, like I said, due to the fact my sound was messed up right here. So, I just had to talk to you guys. So, yeah. I'm just, that's my hamburgers and gravy. I'm still letting it just cook down. And I'm going to put out a little seasonings up. I think that's what I'm doing. So, yeah, you guys. Just thanks for watching my video. Um, oh, I'm back to the rice. I'm back to the rice, y'all. So, the rice is boiling. So, what I'm about to do now, I always make sure your rice is boiling. I put my seasonings in always before so that the seasonings can cook through the rice. I put the rice in and I stir it. Once I stir it and put the lid on it, um, I just let it go. Leave it and forget it. Well, don't forget it because you will burn it or it'll be mushy. But once the water has boiled out, it is cooked through. Turn the heat off so you'll have the heat on boiling. And I put some extra virgin olive oil in it as well because somebody told me that'll help the cranos. But I really don't never have that problem. I was just doing too much probably as usual. So like I said, um, it's still boiling here. Like, girl, you gonna turn that down? So, I was eventually get it down to a low and put the lid on. Yep, as I did right there. So, as you guys can see, um, I'm just letting it boil. It was about to overflow, so I let a little bit of the heat out to cover it again. Oh, it burnt me. Oh, girl, you know better than that. Putting your leg on that hot pot. And this is just my, once again, my hamburgers and gravy. So I think I start by talking here. A little longer. I'll show y'all when it's plated over. But what I do have over here is some green beans. I'm gonna put a little bit of this in there. And of course, sugar. 